more than 1.4 million lives get lost every year because of, because of inhalation of smoke from cooking. And uh, it's, it's quite shocking. And, and most of, the, of, of, of them are women and children. I mean, this is, it's, it's basically 50% more than malaria. The slow burning cooking uh, stoves um, is a very co quite effective solution for that rural area um, because it kind of reduces up to 70% of the smoke in the houses and also um, uses 50% less firewood for it to work. Just as many women and men and children will be living in energy poverty in 20 years' time, that's not development, that's injustice. And, but there is hope, you know, there is always hope, and energy for all is achievable. I still have a dream that in Kenya, 20 years from now, with a photovoltaic and solar revolution, what we will actually see is the rural areas of the country generating the electricity and selling it to the cities. People said, you know, you can't do this in Africa, you know, these technologies are not, you know, they're too complicated, they're too expensive. It's wrong. We are on the equator here. If you cannot produce enough electricity for a building on the equator, where on earth will you do it?